ಬಂದೇ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದು ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀ ನಂದು ನಂದು ನಂಗ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರುಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶ್ಚ ಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂಧುಭ್ಯವಶ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮುಖಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಗ ಹೈತಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂ ಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ್ಯ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಭರ ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೋಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಂಜಿನು ಶರಣ್ಯಂ ಭೀತ್ಯಂ ಪುನತ ಬಾಲ್ಯಭವದ್ದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಲ್ಲವನ ಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರುಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗವಧೂಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಂ ಕರುಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರೌ ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರೌ ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿಬ್ಬರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತ್ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ 
नारायणो प्रिय मनंग मदापहारम वाराणसी पुरापति भज विश्वनाथ वागीशजुष वदने लक्ष्मीर्जस् च वक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संबीत निशिंगमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे कृष्ण कीर्तन गान नर्तन कला पथोजनी भ्राजिता सद्भक्ता बलि हंस चक्र मदूत से विहारास्पदम कर्णानंदी कलधनिर्बहतु मे जिह्वा मरु प्रांगणे श्री चैतन्य दया निधे तप दया कृष्णत कीर्तन गान नर्तन कला पथोजनी भ्राजिता सद्भक्ता बलि हंस चक्र मदूप से विहारास्पदम कर्णानंदी कलधनिर्बहतु मे जिह्वा मरु प्रांगणे श्री चैतन्य दया निधे तब दया इला सुधा सर्धुनी गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमंश जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट वी गौरी डिबोटिस वी आर ऑलवेज रेडी टू गिव गैलेंस ऑफ ब्लैड फॉर द इमांसिपेशन ऑफ दिस फॉल एंड सोल ऑफ दिस सोसाइटी गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत तो सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमंश जगत गुरु सेट दैट वी गौरी डिबोटिस गौरी मठ डिबोटिस आवर ईच एंड एवरी मेम्बर ऑफ गौरी मठ डिबोटी दे आर ऑलवेज रेडी टू सेट गैलेंस ऑफ ब्लैड फॉर द इमांसिपेशन ऑफ दिस फॉल एंड सोल ऑफ दिस सोसाइटी वी आर ऑलवेज सीटिंग रेडी ऑलवेज बट पॉइंट इज दैट they like to go out of maya or not that is the main problem main question is that they like to go out of maya or not that is the main question probad used to say those who are developing shastriya shadhya and those who are developing lokik shadhya two type of shadhya you can see in this material world two type of sadhya one is lokik sadhya lokik sadhya mean by watching your grandmother or grandfather or some devotee you are interested to do something like him but have no background you have no spiritual strength no power nothing that is called lokik shraddha after watching somebody you like to follow you are doing something you have no basic idea about what is called actual bhakti you have no basic idea you have no idea about the tatva of guru vishnu tatva you have no idea only you are watching like small boys you know watching grandmother doing something that type of shraddha is called lokik shraddha so if some people coming in our mart with lokik shraddha if some people coming with some lokik shraddha to mart to our mart then after some day there is every possibility that they can fall down lokik shraddha lokik shraddha also we can say pinimile nishadha odwa what is called actually prakita bhakta you see lokik shraddha but when you can develop 
Shastriya Shraddha, when you can develop Shastriya Shraddha, in that case you can feel some power. Shastriya Shraddha can develop only after actual Sadhu Sangha, you can get Shastriya Shraddha. Without hearing, without hearing Harikatha from the lotus mouth of pure devotees, without hearing Harikatha from the lotus mouth of pure devotees, you cannot develop Shastriya Shraddha, not possible. Those who are developing Shastriya Shraddha, they can stay. Some problem can happen, but still they cannot go away from bhajan. But Lokik Shraddha, most of the people, most of the people all around the world, they have this Lokik Shraddha. Shastriya Shraddha they don't have. That's why this kind of different problem regarding Siddhanta or Vipana Achar and developing. That is why. Popad used to say, people think, people think that we can do Hari Bhajan without serving Guru Vaishnava. But this is absurd. Many times Popad used to say, those who are taking decision to do Hari Bhajan, those who are taking decision to do Hari Bhajan without serving Guru Vaishnava, they can never come out successful. Many times, Popad used to say, those who are serving Guru Vaishnava, actually they are serving Bhagavan. Those who are serving Guru Vaishnava, pure Guru Vaishnava, those who are serving pure Guru Vaishnava, surely they are serving Bhagavan. But those who are going to avoid the service of Guru Vaishnava and like to do Bhagavad Seva directly, there is no possibility. Those who are Sahajiya, they like to avoid serving pure Vaishnavas. Prabhupada speaking, most of the time they are avoiding serving Guru Vaishnava and they like to serve Bhagavan deity. And they like to prove that we are Namanandi Sadhu, we are Rupanuga devotee, we are Aganuga devotee, they like to prove it. But ultimately they cannot come out successful. That is the main problem. Sometimes some miracle happens. Sometimes some miracle happens without taking Diksha, without getting without getting diksha, without serving, you know, externally going to Gurukul, sometimes it happens so. Miracle, sometimes it's very rare case. Very rare case. Bahobo matpadam prapta trashta kaya dhava dayuhu visaparva balirvana mayascha thabibishanaha There's so many you can find in their life, they are not accepting Guru. Practically, if you search their life, Parikhit Maharaj also not accepting. You cannot find the Guru of Parikhit Maharaj. Parikhit Maharaj never accepted initiation from anybody. Vishaparva, Bolir, Vano, they never accepted any Diksha from anybody. But how is it possible for them to attain the lotus feet of Bhagavan? That is the main question. Bhagavan himself speaking. Bhagavan himself speaking to Uddhavji Maharaj. Some miracles. Only by, only by satsanga, and surely that kind of satsanga, not ordinary satsanga. Only by satsanga, they are going to attain my lotus feet. It's a miracle. It's a rare case. They are getting the lotus feet of my lotus feet, Bhagavan speaking. Sometimes it happens so. And why, if you go deep into this philosophy, that why this is happening? Whereas after taking Dikha, we, uh, we cannot make any progress in our bhajan. After taking Diksha, we cannot make any progress in our bhajan. There can be so many reasons. Maybe I have not accepted actual Guru or maybe I am duplicate my 
demand is not good. First of all, point is that people like to understand the utility of the object they are running behind. First of all, they are running behind money because they know the utility of money. They are running behind pratishtha, lab, puja, pratishtha, they, they want to understand. But the, if they don't understand the utility of Bhagavan, if, 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 if they cannot understand the utility of Bhagavan, then how they can get Bhagavan? First of all, you should understand huh? the utility of the object you are running behind. You don't understand the utility of Bhagavan. Actually, you have no demand. Demand is a must. In economics, we know, in economics, we know one sentence in economics. Demand and supply goes together. Demand and all European society, American society, their economy is oscillating like demand and supply. But in our country, they going to make artificial crisis of the object. They no you can get the supply, but they don't allow. They keep it in a store. They make artificial crisis to get more and more higher price, more. This way they are running. This way. So in our life, we should have actual demand. If there is no demand, no question of getting Bhagavan, lotus feet of Bhagavan. If there is no demand in my life, you ask yourself. You need not fight with anybody. You ask yourself, you need Bhagavan or not? Then you can get answer. You ask yourself, you need Bhagavan. If you need Bhagavan 100%, then you can get. If you need Bhagavan 100%, then you can get Bhagavan. This life. But I think we, we don't understand the utility of Bhagavan. What we can get? <coughs> what he can do? That's why big problem. So demand and supply goes together. If we, Prabhupada used to say, if we want Bhagavan from heart, then surely this life we can get Bhagavan. But actually we... So there can be so many reasons for why I am not getting success. First point, maybe my Gurudev is not genuine Gurudev. Maybe. Or maybe I have some duplic duplicity inside my heart. Gurudev is okay. There can be so many reasons for why we are not getting any power in our bhajan. Day by day we are taking red cloth, white cloth, sannyas base, but no power we are feeling inside heart. That is the reason for why. Whereas Bhagavan speaking, speaking to Uddha, many such cases, those gopikas, they never went to Gurukul, Jagik Patnis, they never went to Gurukul. They never gone through Vedas, Upanishad, nothing. Never accepted any guru in their life. Never. But how miracle they are going to get the lotus feet of Bhagavan Singh. They all get my lotus feet. Some demons also. Bishop Baba, Bolir, Bano, they are all demon. They are getting lotus feet. What can be the reason? Actually, their satsanga, by the help of satsanga, first of all, in our devotional life, first of all, we are getting preliminary satsanga. First of all, in our life, getting preliminary satsanga. After feeling, getting preliminary satsanga, we get interest. After that, when we are feeling interest, then we can search Guru. After hearing, which is called Bhatma Padarsha Guru, you know, Bhatma Padarsha. By the help of some, some Guru Vaishnava, I am feeling inspiration. Then after that, when I can think, understand the utility, utility of Bhagavan, then I can search some Guru. I like to take shelter. 
and after te taking shelter again satsang so first of all pilim first of all before entering into bhajan our preliminary satsang and after taking initiation satsang after taking initiation also but that satsang is exclusive of course if you are not going to make if you are not going to make any mistake aparad then that satsanga is very good by that satsanga you can enter into into actual bhajan before that bhajana kriya after taking shelter if 100% saranagati there then immediately all problems solve but usually not so if at the time of diksha unto a lotus feet of a great exalted devotee at the time of diksha if your saranagati is 100% then all problems solve any amount of you know shortage there any amount of shortage i have no knowledge nothing i am foolish no educational no problem yogyata vichare kichu nahi pai tomaro koruna sar but one point that is 100% saranagati is there or not then no problem all other qualities can come automatically i can give you countless example not from outside from our gauriya math our giri maharaj sagar maharaj giri maharaj sagar ma aran maharaj i can give so many example they have no educational qualification they have no educational qualification but when they speak in front of public then all those distinguished honored guest professor big big professor philosopher they seeking maharaj in what subject you have done your uh, uh, page phd i am not speaking story i can show you book all audience they are they are hearing they speaking after hari katha maharaj in what subject you have done phd no educational qualification that is the power of prabhupad power translated so many such cases our jajabur sri maharaj when prabhupad declare that you will have to go to one you know big assembly of all dharma sabha where you will have to represent gauriya math by his crying all big big honored guests and pandit they are coming what i can say prabhupad said no Uh, somebody speaking jajabur ma is crying what you will have to go he will have to go i cannot change my this is going there and he is doing bandana speaking harikatha propa sitting inside all pandit they say be you uh, know sadhu 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 very good top most follow this way big big pandit mane as per the estimation of you know common people or mayavadis is the topmost pandit they all karpatra ji karpati you heard the name topmost mayavadi if you watch his renunciation you can go mad he never take any train or bus any cycle nothing you walking without chappal and taking prasadam in hand not pot nothing so and big pandit mayavadi pandit in kumbha mela kumbha mela they are gauriya mad also going they are also big assembly there big big pandit from different sampraday ramanuja sampraday madhu sampraday nimbarka sampraday all ramanujas ram ramanandi sampraday also all there in there our madhav gosi maharaj they are present there then on behalf of gauriya math popad also arranged but it was long before i am speaking about bhakti to madhav gosi he used to open one tent center in and before that popad used to do after popad gone madhav gosi maharaj to there actually madhav gosi maharaj was the representative of goriamat all big big pandit speaking after that when madhugusimra speaking 
even Karpatri, all the chairman, everybody, they are standing up, giving wide acclamation. Right? What Madhu is speaking is a, is a top. Nobody can beat him. How possible? Madhu Goswami is usually not going to bathe with under nothing. No time, always doing Guru Seva. So they are realized soul. People think, I can read books and speak Harikatha in front of public. Okay, that is your privilege you can do. But by reading book you cannot do. Many times Papa told, it depends upon how much attraction you have for Guru Vaishnava Seva. Many times Papa said. Many times. So many disciples there, they are asking one question, who is doing topmost seva among all your seva? Baba saying, Baba speaking, who is developing tremendous attraction under the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava among you is doing topmost Not speaking in a specific answer. Among you all, who is developing topmost attraction? For Guru Vishnu, he is doing topmost seva. Attraction, you can search your mind if you develop love and affection for Guru Vishnu day by day, increasing automatically. You don't know why. Day by day, you feel, you feel attraction for Guru Vishnu. You like to serve Guru Vishnu. Not that you can give some pranami that is called Guru Seva. Not that. Not that. We have to fulfill the desire of Guru Vishnu. Sri Chaitanya Manabhishtam Stapitam Jena Bhutale. So only by reading books you cannot do. You cannot get realization power. That Gita already Mahabh Bhagavan Tadvidhi Panipatena Paripasna Sevaya Upadekshanti Te Gyanam Gyanino Stattva Darshina. So the reason for why those, you know, Parikhit Maharaj, Bishop Arba, Bolir, Bhana, Mayascha, Atu, Vivishana, all, why they are getting the lotus feet of Krishna, whereas after getting Diksha, we are trying our, our best, but we cannot come out successful. Why, what can be the reason? The reason is one, that we have, we have no 100% faith. 100% faith we don't have unto a lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava. Until and unless we fulfill this condition. That's why I told many times, if there is 5% shortage, you believe 95%, 5% then you are contaminated with Mayavad Vishal. We more or less, more or less we all more or less, we all are contaminated with Mayavad Bichar. More or less, maybe 5% or 2%. Even 1% there, still you cannot get facility. When all doubts and suspicion over, you can realize Guru Vaishnava and Bhagavan one and the same. The day you can realize Guru Vaishnava and Bhagavan one and the same, then you can get success. You can feel that your body is aprakita. You can feel that your body is aprakita. You cannot feel tired to, to speak Harikatha, cannot feel tired to do Harinam, one, one, at least one lakh Harinam. You can never feel tired to discuss, you know, Siddhanta writing, you never feel tired. That means your body is now aprakita body. Chinmai. That is the reason. So, Though externally you can see why I am speaking this, because I can discuss about Madhusan Dad Bhavaji Maharaj. Siddha Madhusan. That's, that's why I am speaking all this, otherwise you cannot realize. So Parikit Maharaj, Popa speaking, only by hearing Harikatha from Paramansa, topmost Paramansa, Paramansa Bharjya, Sri Sri Sukhdev Goswami, his initiation was over by hearing Bhagavatam. Follow. Don't understand. Bhagavatam, total Bhagavatam, itself total Bhagavatam is Krishna. Krishna, na? Total Bhagavatam means Krishna. 
So when Sukhdev Goswami is going to get, give Bhagavad Tattva Rasa, Bhagavad Tattva Vigyan to Parikhit Maharaj, that's when automatically Bhagavan, I mean Sukhdev Goswami is going to give Krishna in his hand. And same thing, when Prabhupada is giving us mantra, through mantra, Prabhupada is giving us what? Jo mantra, so guru, jo guru, so hari. Tasmat sarva prajatneno, eh, guru meva prasadayat. There is a mantra. What is mantra? And the mantra you are getting from guru all same, identical. Jo mantra, so guru, jo guru, so hari. You cannot realize this thing. You can think it's one kind of superfluous thing, not that. In true sense, Jo Manta So Guru, Jo Guru So Hari. So, Bhagavad Katha, total Bhagavad Katha, what going to speak? After, after hearing Bhagavad Katha, after hearing total Bhagavad Katha, what you can get? It is already, you know, Gauriya Siddhanta, you know? Eh? Siman Mahaprabhur Mata Midam Tatradara Nambara. Srimad Bhagavatam Pramana Mamalam Prema Pumartha Mahana. Then Prema Pumartha Mahana means after hearing Bhagavad Katha, you are 100% going to get Prema. But not getting all I make, I speak. Follow. After hearing Bhagavad Katha, actual Harikatha, actual Bhagavad Katha from right source, we are, going, we are supposed to get Krishna Prema. Then, Parikhid Maharaj is successful to get Sarup Siddhi, develop Prema, and after Prema, okay, so many things I already told, Kartik Brata, Sneho, Man, Pranoy, Bhav, eh? so many things you can go up, That's, that is different thing, but uh, in this material platform, uh, up to Prema we can get. After that, you can leave body, you can get chance to go, that is very, High class philosophy, ordinary people cannot understand. So that is the main point. So by only by hearing Bhagavad Katha, Parikit Mahar getting Sarvasiddhi or Krishna Prema. Whereas after taking Diksha, doing Harinam every day and night, you are not developing. Why? Maybe there is some problem. Certainly, certainly, there is some problem. But you will have to sort out that problem by the help of Guru Vishnu. You will have to speak out your heart, your position, my position, is what to do, how to do. Then they can solve this problem. If you do run your vajan fancifully, then never you can come. So, now after hearing Bhagavatam, Parikhit Maharaj was successful. I mean, Sarup Siddhi. But after taking Dikta, we are not getting it. So, uh, only by satsanga, only by satsanga, bahavo mat padam praptya trashta kaya dhava dayohu visaparva balirvana mayas chato vibhishana. Prahlad Maharaj also separately never took any diksha. Only in the womb of mother, what he, what he heard from Naraji, he take it as good. But special mantra. So, if so be the case in your life, if this kind of thing happening in your life, that only by satsanga, only by satsanga, you are developing samandha gyan, you are developing samandha gyan, you are developing prema, then only satsanga, by satsanga. By the kipa of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, by the kipa of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, even those animals, birds and beasts, they are also dancing by the association of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Cows and deers are licking the body of Mahaprabhu, not going away. Not going away. Follow. When Krishna playing on fluids, then all birds and beasts, they become hypnotized. It is written in Benu Gita. Benu Gita, it is those birds, 
they are just stand still like a statue, a portrait picture, portrait. It is written. They cannot move, stand still. And those calf, they are drinking milk from the best of Gomata, mother. When this Bangshidani coming, then they stop drinking milk and the ear is like glass, you know, taking the rasa of Krishna. Rare case. Very rare case. So, satsanga, I told from Jaiva Dharma long ago, the even satsanga fraction of second, lavamattu sadhu sangu. That day in Bengali Katha also I was speaking. One second divided by eleven, that much time. is more than sufficient to get Krishna Prema. Bhagavad Charan. So that is the reason. So, satsanga, if you are doing from heart, actual satsanga, actual satsanga you are doing, actual from heart, I can put guarantee, this life you can go out. But there is so many things are there inside our heart, sanskar. We like you, our like and dislike, our like and dislike, our some prejudicial conception, our particular, different kind of problem contaminated. We cannot accept one sadhu as universal. Follow. We cannot accept one sadhu as universal. We cannot accept. Like one scientist. We cannot say the scientist is from this particular country, from India. We cannot say. Haragobindo Khorana. He done some research on genetic, genetical factor. He is from India. That time, India government was very poor, could not provide any facility. He requested government. Within one hour, I can prove this. If you can give, we have no money. Then he gone to America. American government giving facility. After within two hours, he submit all thesis and prove it. He got Nobel Prize. So now American can say that our scientist is giving Nobel, but actually he is originally from India. So one scientist, you cannot say one scientist is from this particular country. You can, you can never say one scientist or one and sadhu, you cannot say, he is universal, for they can get all facility. So we have some, we have some drawback. We have some problem, that's why we cannot, we cannot come out such. In this way, if you go on doing bhajan infinity pure, then you cannot succeed. But if you can suppose make up, if you can realize sadhu is universal, why you can say he is from this group, from Gaurimar, this, they no, sadhu is universal. A sadhu is for all. A sadhu is for all, for everybody, even for all creatures. When scientists is innovation or discovery is all open to all world, not for any particular you know, country. So this is not good. So now Sila Madhusudan Das Bhaji Maharaj. If you hear about him, you can go mad. He is from a high class Brahmin family. At present it is Bangladesh, where he took birth. At present it is Bangladesh. But he never wanted to marry, but father, mother forcefully arranged marry. Forcefully. But and the first night of marriage, first night, bridegroom staying, that night he gone away from that room and ran towards Vrindavan. Gone to Vrindavan. Gone towards Vrindavan. He don't like to do, he don't like to lead material life. He want to do bhajan. What to do? Where he can get guru? He have no idea about. He is new, new in Vrindavan, never went before. Now, he is sitting at the bank of Jamuna and crying. I have no information. Who can guide me? Where I can get guru? And I heard without guru, nobody can do actual bhajan. So I like to get guru. My demand is perfect. 
I like to do Hari Bhajan. I have no other desire. He is crying at the bank of Jamuna, near Keshi Ghat. In the meantime, suddenly, one sadhu appeared there and speaking to him, Hey, you take bath in Jamuna. You take bath in Jamuna and come. I can give mantra to you. I can give mantra to you. Oh, really? I was delighted to hear. He looking at the sadhu, really? He said, like Aprakita, very powerful sadhu. Go and take bath immediately. Come to me. I can give mantra. He taking bath and coming to him and getting Dasakshar mantra. In a Guru Shampa, there are two types of mantra available. One is Ashtada, 18 syllable word, one is 10. Both powerful, both okay. So we are getting 18, 18 syllable. Then is giving mantra everything. After that, after taking mantra, he was feeling some, he was abnormal feeling. In the meantime, when he close eyes, he don't discover Gurudev, we are gone. He cannot find, like the case of Gopagumar. I told you, Bhirat Bhagavad Gita, Gopagumar taking mantra, after that Guru vanish. Gurudev gone. He is crying, Gurudev, we are gone. After that, time to time, he already met with Gurudev at the bank of ocean at Puri, Nilachal Khetra. You cannot remember, you forget everything. There he met, another time he met, but not always. Gurudev vanished. Gurudev? So this way what happened? Gurudev gone. He stays. And as per the instruction of Gurudev, he went on and are doing this, uh, chanting this mantra, this, that, and ma mantra. Usually they are doing. Abhi. Then after that, he is thinking, so I need some Shiksha Guru. Because my Gurudev only give mantra and gone. Actually, really so. Only taking Diksha is not all. But in our society, you go every mod, everywhere. Not only one, every, any society. They have some biasness. Don't go there. Don't go there. Don't do this. Don't hear this argument. That's why we cannot make any make any progress in our life. Always some sort of progress. Don't go there. Don't do, don't hear. But there are so material. But we need Shiksha Guru. Only Diksha is not all. After taking Diksha, if my Guru Maharaj is not going to explain what is called Diksha, what mantra you have given, what is the procedure through which I should do bhajan, then how I can do it? But at present, mantra is only this is mantra. Prabhupada speaking. I am not speaking. I can open and show you. Prabhupada speaking. At present, mantra, this is mantra. But this is not diksha. Diksha means powerful Gurudev can take all your responsibility. Many times I told, na. Whenever you are taking Diksha unto a lotus feet of Sadguru, if you are 100% inclined, all the responsibility lying with Gurudev to, to deliver you. Now it is not your headache. Since you are not going to prove 100% inclination, that's why your previous papa sinful activities totally cannot go. But the actual meaning of Diksha the actual meaning of Diksha means Dibbo Gyan Yato Dadyat Kuryat Papa Shosangshayam. If I am 100% inclined as the Lotus Pina Gurudev, all my infinity period, whatever sinful activities I have done, my Guru Maharaj has power to burn it up. Like a straw go down, straw go down, one fire, then whole straw go down can burn up and become ass. This is the power. Remember, don't forget. This kind of power is there. This kind of power is there 100%. This kind of power is there. Inside, Paupat. Inside, Bhakti Mano Thakur. Bhakti Mano Puri Goswami Maharaj. They have this kind of power. Kesu Goswami Maharaj. Shidha Goswami Maharaj. 
so power, ah, like fire, like fire. If you are inclined, then no problem. All your previous sinful life, you forget about it. Even Jagai Madhai, what to speak? By the mercy of Nityananda, the, the universal Guru, Nityananda Prabhu, original Guru. By the mercy of Nityananda, they cut all. Even Mahaprabhu going to give warning to everybody. Be careful. Nobody should point out their previous activities. Mahaprabhu speaking. You go through, huh? you can see, check up. Murai Gutta Karcha, Chaitanya Bhagavat, or other books I have, so many. There it is evidence. Mahaprabhu giving warning to all devotees. Nobody should point out their previous activities. Be careful. Now they are already changed. We have no right to speak. Point out, hey, you've done this, this. No. We have no right to speak about the previous activities of whom? That, you know, who, Krishna Karnamitra, Urud? Uh, we have no right to speak anything. So, it's a big. So, at the time of Diksha, all our sinful activity, all the result of sin, all can burn up. You have no, no all responsibility is there lying with Gurudev. That was the power of Gurudev, Prabhupada. So, Diksha Kale Shishya Kare, Diksha Kale Bhakta Kare Atma Samarpan, Shai Kale Guru Tare Kare Atma Sam, Shai Deho Kare Tare Chidananda Mai, eh? Aprakita Dehete Kare Krishna Mai. This is written. Chaitanya Jari. At the time of Diksha, when 100% inclined, then Sadguru can change all his heart. And he can become transcendental aprakita. Chinmai. Say Kale Krishna De Kore Atmosham. Identical with Krishna. Identical with Krishna doesn't mean he can become a second Krishna. Identical means the platform of Krishna is Chinmai. And the Jivatma can also attend this Chinmai platform. Because if you are not in the same platform, Bhakti, Bhakta, Bhagavan all should be in one platform. If no up and down, if up and down, cannot do. It's not possible to do. Sir. Follow what I say. So, Madhusudan is not getting any shiksha, only God diksha. He is searching. He gone, he wanted to pray unto the lotus feet of our Krishnadas Baba Ji, Siddha Krishnadas at Manasi Ganga. Govardhan. I used to stay there near, long time. Siddha Baba here, I used to stay near. And Sanatan Goswami Bhajan Kuti is near, at the bank of Manasi Ganga. All near. Haridev Ji Maharaj also near. Giriraj Maharaj there. Yeah, Giriraj is sitting here. Krishnanath Baba Ji Maharaj, he is going to request Krishnanath Baba Ji Maharaj, you, you guide me so that I can get the seva of Radharani. Get the seva of Radharani mean Radha Govinda seva, Jugal seva. But Krishna Babaji Maharaj speaking, you don't know the name of your Guru Pad Padma, in which parampara we have no identity, only you get mantra. Mantra is okay. What mantra you speak is okay. That's not a problem. But you cannot make any link with your Gurudev because you don't know which parampara. So I cannot guide you that way. So better you can go, so better you can go to Jai Krishna Baba. Jai Krishna Baba is a Siddha Mahatma in Kamaban. I used to stay there. Whenever I used to do Parikram, I used to go there, Siddha Baba Ashram. Whatever bread, whatever chapati they give me, I used to take. So, lie down on ground. Siddha, Jai Krishna Baba Ji Maharaj. Jai Krishna Baba Ji Maharaj, is such a great devotee, Krishna Balaram eh, wanted to drink water from this, in the form of ordinary boy, coward boy. Baba, you have water? Yes. Baba giving. 
After that, Baba could realize they are Krishna and Balaram. One black boy, one white boy. I have the picture, Baba giving water. Some portrait, at that, that time there was, that this, he is also speaking, Jai Krishna Baba. You cannot speak the name of your Gurudev, you cannot speak about Parampara. Oh, we can, you have, no, now you mantra getting. So this way is not possible. When you are getting mantra by the desire of Bhagavan, so this way by the desire of Bhagavan, sometime your Gurudev can appear and give everything. Otherwise, how we can give? Uh, not possible. Then without without guidance, Mahasana Bhajma took decision to commit you know, suicide. Suicide means that we cannot say suicide. He like to leave body. That is more practical. Suicide is a common word. It's very bad. He wanted to leave body in Radha Kunda. He took decision that since nobody ready to guide me and my Guru Maharaj also invisible, I am gone. So I have no way out. So I can jump into Radha Kunda night time with one Giriraj, Giriraj Sila. Giriraj stone, you know, Giriraj. One big Giriraj stone, he tie with his one, with one cloth, Giriraj, like this cloth. He have put 5 kg or 10 kg, Giriraj Sila, and knot it with a sword and jump into Ganga, hey, ma, so jump into Radha Kun to leave body. But suddenly what happens? He cannot see somebody going to help him to come out of Radha Kun, throw and give one plum leaf, plum leaf in the hand and vanish. He is speaking, suddenly I am thrown out of water, Radha Kund, and I discovered one plum leaf in my hand. So when I get back my consciousness, I find one plum leaf in hand, there is some kripa of Radharani, and I could not uh, leave my body this way. So again, finally I approached Krishna Babaji Maharaj. Krishna Babaji Maharaj speaking, it is the direct symptom of Radharani Kipa. Don't worry. Siddha Krishna, Siddha Krishna Bhavaji was speaking. This is the direct symptom of your Radharani Kipa. Don't worry. You can do. You wait. You go again at the bank of Radha Kund and fasting and you cry. The Radharani can speak everything. She can give the plum lip to you, giving some indication. She can also. Then she is going. He is going. Day and night lying without prasad and water. One day in dream, Radha, hey, get up! Go to Surya Kund. There you can get everything. You go to Surya Kund. You can get everything there. You can get all Siddhi, everything. And the mantra you got from me, you have no right to give initiation to anybody. Radha gave some Indi Gurudev already gave. Dasakkar mantra, Radharani also in plum leaves something. But Radharani give warning. You cannot make any disciple with this mantra. With this mantra, you cannot give a, make any disciple, only for you. If you make disciple, then all finish. You can get all power can go. Okay. Then Siddha Mahasandas Vaya went to Surya Kund where Ma, when I was there in Sujan temple, Sujan temple there in the north direction and here in northeast, western direction, he is Bhajan Kutir. Those Brajabhasis someday told me that we have the deities worshipped by Jagannath Baba Ji Maharaj. Baba, if you can stay here, we can allow you a Bhajan Kutir and this deity. I say, oh, I cannot stay this way because my Guru Vargo give. Still today, that date is there in one Bhojubhaji's house. I went there to do Madhukuri. They suggested me, if you can stay there in this Bhajan Kutir, we can repair this Bhajan Kutir and uh, you can take Chapati from us, we can give. And the date is also there. 
He was feeling greedy. But after that, thinking this is not the order of Prabhupada. I should not do it. It is, it is not good. Our procedure is very tough. Our bhajan and preaching, same significant. Our bhajan and preaching, all same significant. If my harikatha is not giving same significance, then it's not good. My harikatha means it's topmost bhajan. So how, when harikatha and preaching, the same significance is how tough. It's very easy for me to get chapati from Bhujabhasi and do harina. Personally, I can do. But how tough to adjust with you all? Follow. That's why Gauriya Bhajan is more practical. Popa told that if you can make adjustment with all, if I cannot make proper adjustment with you all, follow. Everybody not see the Mahatma. Everybody. So those who are exalted devotees, they have some special power. I don't know why. Any people coming there as if they feel adjusted with Guru. They feel that Maharaj loves me very much. Adjustment means he can adjust, they, they cannot adjust. One side. And the Guru is not feel that. So this adjustment, different problem can come, different devotees can come with different problem and complain, different objection, different you know, question. So if you are going to get adjusted with them by the mercy of Prabhupada, that is called topmost bhajan. Personally, if you give me order, you give me order in written form, I cannot speak any harikatha. If you give all devotees, I can say it is a desire, Prabhupada. I can go and sit and do bhajan. But I don't like to do it because it is not the order of Prabhupada. So, Jagannath Das Bhajma started doing bhajan there. And Radharani already told, if you go into the water, Radharani already told, if you go into the water, a certain distance, not so depth, you can find one stone, big stone, red stone. That stone is that special stone. When every day I used to worship Sujana and Bhagavan, that time I used to keep my crown and bangle everything and chain in the stone. Me and my sister, Ananga Manjuri. Both of us used to put all ornament there. Then we used to take bath, again come out with new clothes. Again we put. That stone is melted. I mean you can get the impression of that bangle and crown there. Better you can get the stone out of the water and put in the temple and go on worshipping. You can get mangal. So as far the, still today is there. If you go there, the stone is there. So every day they are worshipping that. Babaji Maharaj also used to worship. Every day used to worship. And shed tears because it's a transcendental of prakit. But Mahasandas Babaji Maharaj, as per the instruction of Radharani, never wanted to give diksha to anybody. Follow. But our Jagannath Das Babaji Maharaj took this dress. Jagannath Das Babaji Maharaj. Now finally it was discovered that our Mahasandas Das Babaji Maharaj in the line of Vishwana Chakravarti. It was discovered later. Like in our case. It was not discovered that in which line we are. So many Sahajiya, Radha Kunda, Babaji were speaking all. By the desire of Guru Vaishnav, I was bound to write one book. Madhya Gauriya, what is, what is your doubt in Madhya Gauriya Sampradaya? One book I wrote, 15 years back. That is not translated. I give it in the hand of the topmost, you know, fighter against Mayavadi. That is Anantada, Anantadas. He is uh, died now. Live. I send one man with whom he had some, some nice relation. I send all book to him. Let him give answer to me. He couldn't give answer. Amar Prabhur Katha. 
You publish, no? That I published long ago, 15, 6 years back. Now you publish as per my desire. Amar Prabhur Katha. They have Prabhupada's writing. If somebody having special information about my Guru Pad Padma, please let me know. But finally it was discovered that we are in Advaita line. Advaita Gosai line. Anyway, uh, that, you know, Mohsan Bhavi Maharaj was discovered that he is in a line of Vishwana Chakvatibad. Vishwana Chakvatibad and from Vishwana Chakvatibad he is getting actually Mantra Parampara, actually we can say Bhagavad Parampara. Because after Vishwana Chakvatibad, uh, our uh, Baldev Vidyavasan took lesson from him, Bhagavad Tattva Vigyan, Baldev Vidyavasan. All Bhagavatam he learned from scientist, scientific way, from Vishnu. So, Bhagavad Parampara is more practical. After the Uddhav Das and somebody from Baldev Vidyavasan, after that, again some devotee, uh, Radha Damodar, some Damodar Das. No, Radha Damodar Das is uh, the disciple of uh, Rasikananda, he is the disciple of Samananda. Uh, uh, Radha Damodar is a, uh, you know, is a guru of uh, uh, Baladev Vidyavashan. But I am speaking about Shikha Guru. Mane Bhagavad Parampara, uh, it's called Bhagavad Parampara. Actually, if you search the guru of Baladev Vidyavashan, then Vishwana, from Vishwana Chakudi, he ne never took mantra, took shiksha. So, Bhagavad Parampara is also practical. From there, some devotee. After that, our, uh, this Mahuswandar Bhaj, from there, Jagannath Das Bhaj Maharaj, uh, follow. Then, Bhagavan Das Bhaj Maharaj, then after that, Gaurkisya Bhaj Maharaj, Bhagavad Parampara. We have chart, I have chart. I already published that time. So, this way, Mohsan Bhaji Maharaj was successful. He got the darshan of Radharani, everything. She was successful. Very nice bhajan. Still today they arrange, particularly this day, they arrange big function of Tiruvaptiti, Surya Kundo. Surya Kundo there. They arrange one big function. Anyway, we have so many things to speak, but time is limited. Today is Avirvaptiti of Sila. Bhakti Jivan Janadhan Goswami Maharaj. Today is the Abhir Bhakti of Bhakti Jivan Janadhan Maharaj. Really so. Bhakti was a life. Bhakti was life. Bhakti was his life. Bhakti Jivan. Without Bhakti, I never was. Because you have no practical experience. You have never seen him. You have never seen. So how you can realize? You don't know what kind of a you know, gigantic personality he was. So nice. He took shelter onto a lotus feet of Prabhupada in young age, very young age. I heard from some of his disciples that he is in the line of Raya Ramananda Bamsa, Mani not Diksha Paramparana. Raya Ramananda destiny, you know, their line. Radhavananda, some four or five or six or seven, Adastan, I heard that he is in the, in, in the Bamsa, you know, Bamsa Parampara, heretical Parampara of Sri Radhavananda, I heard it. A very big, high family, very nice, so soft personality, so soft personality. <coughs> He took Diksha from Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada. And he took sannyas from Vaikhanas Goswami Maharaj. You heard the name of Vaikhanas. I spoke Halikatha of so many Guru Varga. So many. Our Bhakti, um, uh, our Vaikhanas Goswami Maharaj. Bhakti Gaurav Vaikhanas Goswami Maharaj who is a Raj Pandit. Raj Pandit was. I told him, your Surya Bhagavan came in front of him, I told him, no? 
previously used to worship Sarvi. So, he was a very from high family. When he came, then Prabhupada wanted to give him seva in Chaitanya Mart. So many is, is from a nice family. But not Brahman externally, but more than Brahman. Externally, not from Brahman heritage, but is more than Brahman. His simplicity. All 18 different Puran, if you ask him any question, he could speak. All 18 different Puran. Anything you put question, he can. He was a Puran Bhakta. Bhakta, speaker, anytime. He can speak hours after hours. Follow. A so simple hearted. Has tremendous, tremendous love unto a lotus feet of Sila Prabhupada. And Vaishnavas. All Vaishnavas. So nice. He used to serve Guru Vaishnava all the time. So he was given sanya after Prabhupada gone at different temple. He went to he was in charge of Chatak Parvat, I mean in Orissa. He was given some seva in Chaitanya Mart. He was given some seva in South India, different places, Kobur, different places. He was given seva by Prabhupada, you go. So no attachment for money, position, Kamini Kanchan, never. Kamini Kanchan, Pratishta, love, never could touch his heart. So pure devotee. Never he wanted to run from money position. Whatever coming, by the desire of Bhagavan he used to do. After Prabhupada gone, he took sannyas. And usually Prabhupada used to send him in the preaching party with some other Guru Bhargava. With some other Guru Bhargava, with some other Guru Varga, Prabhupada used to send him, in, send him in preaching party. He used to go and help them. He can speak all Puran everything. Puran everything. Follow. But usually he is not going for preaching field. Understand, na? Meaning? They know all Sastra, but usually not going in preaching field. Prabhupada used to send him help. For preaching, actually that time Rai Rama, 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 Ramananda Prabhu, our, our Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, Banu Goswami Maharaj, Nanda Sunu, Nanda Sunu Brahmachari, follow, Goswami Maharaj, Aprakit Babu, they used to go, I used to go. Follow. Yeah, as such, he was not you know, a big, you know, outside, externally, he was not a big preacher. We can speak very well. Very nice, non-stop. But it's not externally you can like my Guru Maharaj. Externally you cannot write this book. But he's a big picture. He used to write so many writing. He used to go with Madhav Goswami. Personally he is not going. Follow with Guru Vaishnava. This way. So after Prabhupada gone, what to do? Different situation was there by the desire of Bhagavan. So he took decision to stay with some like Bhakti Vaibhav Puri Goswami Maharaj, you know. Bhakti Vaibhav. Some days he stayed with Vaikhanas Goswami Maharaj. After that, Vaikhanas Goswami Maharaj used to love him very much. Bhakti Vaibhav Puri Maharaj also used to love him very much. Very much. So, they used to stay with them, all God brothers. And Karakpur, finally, in Subhaspalli, in my whole life, I want, went for one time. One time. I have no time. Long ago, 10, 12 years back, they invited me. I went there to speak Harikatha. I spoke by the desire of Bhagavan. I stayed there for one day or so one and a half days. After that, I came back. Anyway, so, Tirobab and Avirbha are very close. Just, Tirobab just gone. Two, three days before. 17 or 18. And Abhirbhav is this. Just close, very close. So, they arrange function in a such a way, they can cover up this Tirobhav and Abhirbhav. But every people, they cannot stay for a long time. For four, four, three, four days. So, I went there in his Bhajan Kuti. I have seen, he has a great friendship with 
our our uh, our our Bhakti Vedanta Vaman Goshi Maharaj. They had friendship, very nice friendship, close friendship. So finally, he was bound to make one mart by the desire of Bhagavan, as Subhaspalli, make a nice mart. After that, he wanted to install the deity and the deity of Prabhupada. Prabhupada wanted to install. He already gave order in Jaipur. Already given order to Jaipur. Whenever, whenever one exalted devotee Mahabhagavat, whenever one great Bhagavat, Mahabhagavat, is going to give order of one deity, then you can understand it is self manifested. When bonded soul out of money power is going to give order to a sculpture, sculpture of man, that is not self, self manifested. When one exalted devotee, like Janadhan Maha, Bhakti Mahapurya, Siddhar Goswami, it was already proved. It already proved. Because I told you in Sarbhok, when Prabhupada wanted to install the deity, give the responsibility to our Ramananda Prabhu, Siddhar Goswami, to make some preliminary arrangement, but he already gave garland and dress when Prabhupada entered, he say, what I can do? He already installed. So you see the eyes of Prabhupada. You see the eyes of Prabhupada open the, open the screen and look at the deity. Well, it's already installed. No need of installation. Already installed. He come back. Then Sridhar Maharaj, I mean Ramananda Prabhu started crying. He thought, I have done some mistake and to lose with the Prabhupada. After they started crying so heavily, finally Prabhupada was bound to say, Remember, those who are 100% inclined and the lotus feet of Guru Padma like you, no offense can be there. Don't worry. Siddharma thought I have, I have done some mistake. Why Prabhupada gone happy? But Prabhupada, Prabhupada wanted to say, that those who are 100% inclined on the lotus feet of Guru Vaishnav, no offense, they cannot, they can make no offense. Bhagavan not going to take any, Bhagavan not going to count. No, you go. I really mean it was installed. Not that you have done some mistake. You have done well done. Bigra, all the pran life already come, already came. That's why I told. This way, Follow what I say. So, when one exalted devotee going to give order to any particular artist, then be sure, according to the desire of that devotee, what is there inside her, that taking form. Taking form. That's why that deity coming to his bhajan guru by one transportation. From Jaipur transportation coming. Coming in his bhajan kutir, I mean the temple, I mean they are going to open. Whenever this, uh, you know, packet, packet, Popa, deity, Radha Govinda, whenever they are going to unload, immediately Maharaj crying, ready with the arthi, arthi plate. <laughs> ready with the arthi plate. And crying, immediately, immediately, immediately open the Immediately open the, you know, packing, open. Popa feeling suffocation. They immediately when the cartoon was opened, Maharaj started doing arati. No installation, nothing, only coming in a packet only, inside the package. Open, open immediately. Popa feeling suffocation and started doing arati. So understand the mood? That's mean? He could see Prabhupada is originally there. So, Ramanuja Chajo also spoke same thing. When one, when one great exalted devotee, when one great exalted devotee installed one deity, then we have our right to pay. Pranam. Any deity installed by one material man, we have no need. 
Actually, as such, one Paramahansa can pay Dandava to everybody. That's not a issue. Raman, Ram, Ram, Ramanujaj was speaking that if any deity installed by any bonded soul, by, if, 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 if installed by any great Paramahansa, but after a long time, is that deity worship is, you know, they are not following proper procedure, many contamination. Now, due to parampara succession, that material parampara took place material parampara. I mean, Ramanujaj want to say, if some material man now go to worship, then Bhagavan cannot take worship. When some demon going to touch that devotee, when some, Ramanujaj is speaking, when some demon going to touch that deity, doing worship, so many things, then the life from the deity going away. Ramanujaj is speaking, no, no, no more, that is deity. That is Nibhigya idol. Because for a long time ignored, for a long time this deity is being ignored by those demons. I can show you, come with me, so many such deity. But very secretly you will have to be very like a secret, like in a, a secret agency. You will have to go there. Don't prove that I like to see. I can show you. Jagannath, Baladev, Subhadev, everywhere, everywhere they are doing all rubbish. Night time they are doing all rubbish. Day time they are going to bring some flower to Jesus and come out. No worship. How many, how many deities you like to see? I can show you. But don't speak that I have come to, uh, like a secret agency you will have to go. I can show you. They demo. They don't believe in deity, nothing. Same thing happened. One Maharaj is there, he used to love me very much. He is a disciple of Bhakti Kamal Mohsen Goswami. He was invited to install one deity in Giriraj Maharaj, Govardhan. I never went there. I like to avoid that man. But Maharaj, after deity ceremony installation was there, oh, big bandar, everything. Next day, Maharaj went morning time, very early in the morning. After Arati, went to Nandagram, Barsana, so many things. Next day, he is coming and watching the same garland, same tulsi, same mala. Like Mayavadi, Mara started crying. That's why I don't like to install any deity. So many people put pressure on me. Maharaj, you have to. No, Mari, only you touch, you can. No, I am not such a great devotee that I can touch and the devotee can come. Rascal. Many devotees. Because if you can touch, is it? Um, no, I don't think so. I cannot. Better you can hear Harikatha. I cannot help. I cannot install. Because I know, today they can get installed by me and tomorrow they can ignore all the sinful aparat. So I don't. So this way, Ramanuja is speaking, suppose one deity is long, suppose one deity is lying, suppose one deity is lying for long time, ignored. Lying for long time. Nobody owes him. Nobody was. Like one case happened in Calcutta, Dam Dam. Follow. My Guru Maharaj installed. After that, something happened there. Police came and locked the temple for a long time. Deity is there inside. Seven, eight, ten years. Twelve or more than that, fifteen years. After that, some Maharaj, case is over and temple, he took this one. So my Guru Maharaj used to cry. It was installed by Guru Mahal. Every day used to cry in the name of our deity. And used to worship him mentally. Yes. Follow. So Ramanuja used to say, if for a long time one deity on Bigraha is, is being ignored by those demons, by chance one great devotee coming there, great exalted devotee, like Prabhupada coming there, is going to pay Dandava to deity, again life can come, immediately. Immediately, instant. When Prabhupada paid Dandava, Bhakti immediately, no need of installation. 
Ramana says no need of installation. Only one great exalted who can pay Dandava immediately can come. Same case happened in Dhaka, you know, Dhaka, Julanbari, in the year of 1923. I, I wanted to put this date there. Pope was speaking Harikatha. Janma Dasso Jyate Anamayadi Sloka, first sloka in Bhagavata, for one month and doing Harina. One day, for a long time, one devotee requesting, please, if, if you install this uh, Pigra, Pope was saying, no need of you here. No, you feel. But finally, Pope was told, okay, you can bring the devotee to here. Okay, I can also. Then coming here, Pope was with Chandan. And flower, giving under the rest with the deity, give one garland, tulsi, go, it is installed. Papa speaking, now it's installed, go. It's not angry. Anyway, <clears throat> Janadhan Mahath is a great devotee. <clears throat> I like to speak so many things about him. So many Siddhanta Vichara, so many things, but time cannot permit. Actually, excuse me what to do. Time is limited and you are not giving me sufficient time to speak. Krishna Kirtana Gana Nartana Kala Patho Jani Rajita Sadhavakta Vali Hangsa Chakra Malpo Seni Biharas Padam Karna Nandi Kala Dhanir Bhatume Jiva Maru Prangani Se Chaitana Dayani Deta Balasan Leela Sudha Sarduni Vāñca-kalpa-tarusika-pāsana-bhai-patitānaṁ-pāvana-varśna-bhyo-namā. Jāya-sara-mausandāt-bhāvajī-mahārāja-kī, Jāya-sara-janatana-vusai-mahārā